Hello guys, I'm Kyo, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last episode, we did stuff. And we got the super jumpy ultra boots. In this episode... We're going to my favorite chapter in the game. But not before upgrading a person, oh boy! <laughs> Let's see... Uh. Air Raid, Fan Smack, Hurricane, uh, Air Raid? I don't even know anymore. I don't even know anymore, guys. I do not know. Anyway, enough goofing around. I'm so excited. Here we go. Chapter 7 Star Spirit on Ice. Okay, welcome to Banquet Village or Bumpy Village or whatever. Oh my god! Yay! <laughs> okay, enough. Oh my god, I love these cute little guys. They're adorable! Hey, you have a third degree card. I got a third degree card too. Cool! It's the same ranking. We're equals. That's cool, Banquet Dude. The city's becoming pretty dangerous lately. I saw this totally suspicious stranger wandering just a short while ago. He seemed to be searching for something. He did, didn't like his I didn't like his looks. I wonder where he got off to. Oh my god, these guys are cute. Oh my god, this song! Pengy, pengy, penguin pop. Feel the ribbon stop and pop. Do the pengy, penguin hop. All the snowmen and a line of bucket hats fit super fine. Eyes and noses still looking cool, bring a scarfy pingy fool. Fun fact, I actually drew like a piece of art for that specific one. I don't know why, but it's cute! Anyone for shaved ice treat, strawberry fraser, maybe watermelon? Or maybe my personal favorite tangerine? Tangy tangerine? <laughs> I love frozen treats. Me too, buddy! You're cute! You're all cute! We're going out this window. I don't know why. Who knows? I don't know. Should I know? I probably shouldn't know. I bet you we can go through another window. Ho ho. Also, well, this is one of my favorite songs in the game. I don't know. Just like, I listen to it a lot and it's just like nice. Ooh, an item. Sound effects E. Nice musical effects. Nice sound effects. Nice everything. Yay, penguin bumpties, birds, flightless birds. Blue penguins. Cute. A really shady individual came to the city recently. He was screaming at the top of his lungs and running around. It was really odd. I think something strange is going on in our peaceful city. Oh no, something odd. Let's save the birds. You're... you're cute. Oh, we have a guest. Welcome. You poor man, you must be freezing. If you'd like to see my husband, he's in the air room. Please, go right in. Thank you. You're so sweet. And... Um... Uh... Um... Darling, would you like a cup of tea? Hmm? Oh. Dear, you'll know you catch cold if you sleep there. Help! Someone! Anybody! My husband's dead! He's been murdered! It's a penguin mystery murder. Did I screw it up? Huh. Well, this took a turn. What's going on here, madam? Just calm down now. I need to speak slowly so I can get to the bottom of this. My husband is dead. Look at him lying there. 
Oh my darling husband. Someone clipped his flippers. By Puffin, you're right. The mayor's been murdered. This is like a like mystery novel. Except it's real. How tragic. But madam, if I may ask, what earth would have to put this penguin on ice? Him, right there! That man with the most suspicious mustache! I told him not to come in the house, but he barged right in! Wait a minute, ma'am. You let you said it was okay to visit the mayor. Gosh. My husband is run alive right up until this man showed up. He must be the murderer. Hey, you, mustache. Are you listening? This good woman's accusing you. What do you have to say for yourself? Not me, dude. Don't try to pray lay innocent for me, buddy. I'm a professional. I've got a witness here. Isn't that right, madam? Yes, that's right. He did in cold blood. I, uh, saw with my own eyes. Besides, he's the only one who came into this room. It all adds up. Sir, sticking with your story, claiming you're not the culprit? Mari didn't do anything. He's obviously innocent. Hmm. You're telling the truth. And we're dealing with back room murder case. Oh, he never trained for this. Backroom murder case. A high ranked penguin slain. How could such a horrible plot twist hit our, hit our peaceful city? You, Mr. Mustache. Once more for the record, you swear you didn't do this. Okay. I think I believe you. But this means we have to find the true murderer. Ah, perfect. I'll give you a chance. Since you claim you're not the guilty party, then you must bring me the murderer yourself. If you do that, I'll believe you. It's the only way. Alright, off with you. You haven't, you haven't proved you're innocent yet, so I must forbid you to leave the city. No reply, Mary, Mary Penguin's body doesn't move it, budge an inch. What's this? He has a memo in his hand that says Herring Lay. Also a present. This is scary! No, why why murder a penguin, dude? Still our main suspect, so I advise you go find a real criminal and fast. You killed him, didn't you? I knew my instincts were right. I saw a stranger like you out here in such a remote place. I knew you must that you must be up to no good. Oh the horror. My poor poor penguin kins. Please forgive me for laying this murder in the house. Ma'am I promise you, I'm not a penguin murderer. In fact, I would be the very... That would be the, literally the last thing I'd do. Uh, probably. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not going to help you. I don't socialize with murderers. Get away from me. Hello? Her penguin was murdered. In his back room. And no one has the ass, uh, slyest idea who did it. Oh, it can't be. It's not... It's like we're in one of Herringway's mystery novels. How could such a terrible thing happen in such a small, peaceful city? Who could do such a thing? Not me. The mayor's wife said the man with the mustache did it. He seemed to be such a gentleman, too. Still, I guess he shouldn't trust anyone who carries such a huge hammer. <laughs> How terrifying. Just goes to show you should never trust your first impressions on pe of people. Herringway? Why, he's a mystery novelist who lives in the city. You suspect Herringway? Nah, he couldn't, it couldn't be him. He and the mayor are friends. Hmm. Yeah, but that's the only lead. Do you know anything? You, penguin killer! You just keep your distance. Well, with that gleam in your eye. No! I'm gonna be a murder victim. Please, somebody help. No! Dude! Give me your song, please! Sing your song to me! I miss your song! No! <laughs> I'm having too much fun with this. Oh my gosh. Hangway? Yeah, sure he lives right next to a lake. This house is always empty though, who knows where he is. What? Apparently he might be a murderer. No! He can't be. He's a really good friend of the mayor's. He'd have no reason to off him. Unless there's some super secret like, reason. Ever since I started reading Herringway's mystery novels, I suspect the unsuspected. What about in here? Empty room. Empty rooms are no help in this murder case. What shall we do? Chuck! Chuck Quizmo! Will you help us? 
You're not gonna help us with- let's do a quiz anyway. <laughs> Question. What color of pants is Goomba King wearing? Blue and red. Oh. Probably red and blue. No! I am bad at quizzes, guys. The sad part is, I was watching my older parts with... Because some of my friends were watching them. It was a time grand indeed. Hey, you have... Yeah, you, you, you know. Let's go into the freezing... Let's go into the malt shop. Hello? Look, I'm not selling anything to Penguin... Mayor Penguin's killer. Yeah, there, will you? I didn't kill the Bumpty! Please! Hello? Better show some evidence that you're not really... That you're not really the one who murdered Peng Mayor Penguin. Unless you do, I'm sorry, okay, at least see? I won't budge for the spot oh, no, sorry. I'm serious now, there's no way it's trying to move me. Am I being too rude? Sorry. That he 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 is my spirit animal. <laughs> I'm so dumb. Hello, Toad, help me. Huh? You look okay to me, Mario. You sure you feel like taking a nap? Okay, you're you're not you're you're not you're not you're not suspecting. You remember that you kicked Mario Penguin, Mayor Penguin? Did you really do it? I don't think you did. I bet it was that crazy guy I ever saw running around here the other day. It was weird. It don't look so weird. Well, thank you, sir. At least some penguins don't suspect me of murder. I hear about Shiver Sagan. I hardly ever talk to these girls, but you can, like, find them in a lot of places. Not that I've noticed. But hey, who knows? Wee! Slide on the slope. I can't slide on the slope. This is Harry Lang's house. He's a novelist. Harry Lang should be in there, but I haven't seen him lately. It's very peculiar. Really? Hello? You're not in here. Are you in here? No, you're not there. He is not in here, guys. I can't confirm. I explored his house a tiny bit. Hello? I said, I don't talk to penguin killers. <laughs> Please, let me through. Uh, hello? You're the number one suspect in the mayor's murder. Can't let you leave, say, not until you prove you're innocent. What shall we do? This penguin lings a warehouse no one can get in because some hairless guard may Iron Man just lose the key to the door. I can't believe I lost it. I ought to retreat. Use my steps. Hey, find a key anywhere, let me know, okay? Well, here's a key down here. Also, foot, snow footprints, and ice. That's a thing. Let's break the ice, shall we? Ow. And now. Fishy must go into the freezing, freezing, freezing water. Dive! We get the warehouse key. Crazy stuff, I mean. And now we can get in here. You're welcome, dude. Thanks for finding that key. I would have been the trouble if I couldn't get inside. Sure thing, pal. Let's go up the stairs, sir. Let's go up the screen. Feel like Santa! Whoa, Santa! Let's be Santa, guys. Hello? Wanda! Why are you in my fireplace? You found my secret room. Through the chimney. Ingenious. Hello? Me? I'm Harryway, the novelist. Have you heard of me? What? Mayor Penguin's murdered, and I'm the chief suspect. You must be joking. It's ridiculous. I didn't know such thing. You're very suspicious, huh? Well, I suppose I would be too. Here it says so I should drop in at the mayor's house. Engage stairs. Thanks, you're at stairs. Alright then. Come on. Let's go to the mayor's house. 
Secret stairs. Awesome. What's over here? Paper. Paper and more paper. We're being used for entertainment purposes, people. Oh no. Let's go! Herring way to a new realm and place in the city. I guess I don't know. Oh no, the door closed on me. That was bad. Let's get to the bottom of this case right now. Right away, sir. Hello. You killed him. Blah, 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 blah. Hello. Oh, you again. Have you come up with anything? Hmm? Say, isn't that penguin behind you the mystery novel, novel writer Herring? What? 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 Mayor Penguin was clutched. Pe a piece of paper that had Herringway written on it? <laughs> that were true, I would most certainly have noticed it. Hmm? He definitely does appear to be holding a piece of paper. Yes, of course. It's a message about his death. For his last breath, Mayor told us the murderer's identity. So, Mr. Herringway, cold-hearted murderer. All makes sense now. No wonder your novels were so exciting and suspenseful. You live out your own plots. Dear man, do you have any idea how ridiculous you sound? Are you actually think I would do this to the mayor? He's a great friend of mine. Hmm, yes. Yes, you were good friends. <laughs> but that's just as a cover so no one would suspect you of this heinous crime. That's it, isn't it? I've solved this crafty mystery. Oh, come on, really? Simple, simple penguin. I would never do any so, un so predictable. Blah, blah, blah. I'd never be so predictable. Besides, I'm completely innocent. I've been working in my house on my new novel for weeks. I didn't have time to sneak out of here and kill the mayor penguin. I'd just like to say that I still think this man with mustache is murder. Penguin murder mystery is getting more intriguing by all the time. What? Uh, uh, oh my aching. Ouch. E my husband's returned! He's a ghost! Oh good gracious. Hello everyone. What's going on here? What? Mayor, we thought you were dead. Our backroom murder mystery was lost. What a plot twist. Huh? What are you talking about? Um... I think... I seem to remember going to the salt to get the souvenir for Herringway. Oh yes, of course. I reached up, slipped, and then whacked my head on the floor. Yes, that's what happened. Here you are, Paint Herringway. This is what I was reaching for. That town was a f great fun, so many interesting sights. I wish I could have been there. Sometime after all this hubbub settles down, I'll give you a full account of this big city. Of the big city. Well, uh, thank you, old friend. That was very thoughtful. But, Mayor, here we were thinking that you'd been murdered. This whole city was up in arms. Next time, please be more careful. Uh, yes, yeah, so sorry. <laughs> I thought I'd rather be. It was rather entertaining myself. Actually, besides, everything's okay now. The mayor's just fine. I must return to my home now. I believe I just had an idea for a sequel to my new novel. Um. I had the best into intentions, but for some reason, all these things end up on a ruckus. Hello. Sorry about all that. I must apologize. Say, you're Mario, aren't you? Well, welcome me welcome to you to Shiver Sea, Jewel of the North. What's the matter? Oh, you want to hike over to Starborn Valley, do you? I see, of course. I'll tell the gatekeeper to allow you out the city. You better bundle up. Please go back to the north. 
lands, what, for scenery? Aren't much for scenery, but there's always plenty of sense. Only joking, only joking, you'll only get a warm welcome around here. I... I knew you were all innocent the whole time. The back room murder case? Please, how completely silly. The overcellus garden must be reading too many novels. <laughs> anyway... Yeah, sure. Sure. You're all still cute. Anyways, um, with that, I think I'm getting the episode off there. The mystery penguin murder case has been complete. And, yeah. It's full of suspension action. I think that's enough for today. So, then I'm getting the episode off there. So, next time on Let's Play Paper Mario, we'll be unfortunately going away from Shiver City, home of the adorable penguins in the world. Hello? For Puffin's sake, Mayor's wife is an alarmist. Although I bet everyone involved in that case would agree that my detective board was perfect. Yeah, it was, buddy. It sure was. Anyway, thank you, buddy. It's okay. Next time on Let's Play Paper Mario, we'll be hanging off out of Shiver City and going further to Starborn Valley. See you guys then.